triple homicide arrest is not Jacob Van Winkle's first run-in with the law. KRDO News Channel 13's Dana Molina has been digging into Van Winkle's past, and she joins us live in the Newsplex with information that's new at 5. Dana? James, Heather, I've been looking through court records and making phone calls about the suspect, and I found that Jacob Van Winkle has a lengthy rap sheet going back 10 years. This is Jacob Van Winkle, a registered sex offender who served multiple sentences for a variety of crimes. First in Indiana, in August 2004, he was charged with one count of battery. Two months later, a count of criminal mischief dismissed. That November, he pleaded guilty to child molestation and performing a sexual misconduct in the presence of a minor. He served three years behind bars. In 2008, Van Winkle was charged with theft. He pleaded guilty and served jail time. Then in 2010, he pleaded guilty to disorderly conduct and was sentenced to probation. He violated that probation and it was revoked. In 2011, he was arrested after his roommate was found dead. Van Winkle was found hiding in the woods, but no charges were filed. It was determined his roommate died of a heart attack. Van Winkle has a criminal history in Colorado, too. In 2012, he pleaded guilty to misdemeanor assault. Charges of false imprisonment and reckless endangerment were dismissed as part of a plea deal. In this latest crime, he faces charges of first-degree murder, kidnapping, sexual assault, and sexual assault on a child by a person in a position of trust. And Van Winkle is scheduled in court on Wednesday when charges will be formally filed against him. Live in the Newsplex, Dana Molina, Cardio News Channel 13. Dana, thanks.